a shower. This towel is long. Anyways, I'm trying to get the color to come back to my skin here. I'm not that white. I'm white, but I'm not that white. Okay. So anyways, we're going to make a salad, and I thought I'd just take a video of me making a salad. Okay, we're in my room now. Super exciting change of scenery. Okay, this pimple. Oh, oh, I caught that in the air. <laughs> now, folks. <laughs> you may have noticed that my hair is a little wet. That's because it is. In order to look less like a drowned rat while I show you this amazing recipe, we're going to blow dry this mother. You're literally trying not to laugh at yourself as you do things. You don't know my life. It's nowhere near dry, but it'll do. For now. a way to put up the selfie stick with my phone so it's not actually gonna fall. Wow. <sighs> Progression. Progressive. Progressing. We're done with this conversation. First of all, what we're gonna do is take this away so I can see myself in the table. We're gonna make a salad. I want something fresh, summery. It's really, really good. I love chickpea salads. So, Let's make a goddamn chickpea salad. Let's just get straight to it now that my hair is somewhat dry and I look less like a drowned rat. First off, cutting board. You know why? Because I can't exactly chop stuff up without it. State of the art, cutting board. Bought Dollarama. Before we get everything going here, chickpeas are the base of this mofo. Chickpeas are chickpeas. I'm not about to buy a brand name because like, why am I gonna pay more when it's the same shit in the container? You know, basically just gonna rinse them out of the sink. All right, welcome back to Cooking with Riley. Now, we're gonna set ourselves up for success here, okay? First of all, we've got the chickpeas. Chick peas. Protein. They're little nude colored balls of protein. We all love nude stuff. First on the agenda. Now you may be wondering why tears of the people I have offended. You might be wondering why I have this glass with ice in it. And that's because I'm about to fuck up some wine. Let's try that again. I see people do it, so I'm actually really curious. Do it like it? It's not what they do. Maybe if I do it and blow it at the same time. Australian wine, 13.5%, one liter. Got some undertones of peach and honey. Any wine with peach in it is my favorite stuff. our inspiration. Cheers. Oh. It's so good. Mm. Chickpeas, check. Wine, check. Water to make myself feel better about having wine during the middle of the day. Check. We got tomatoes. Let's talk about tomatoes, okay? They're red. They're round. They want to be eaten. I wasn't choosing a brand or anything that says Campari on it. The Tomato Lover's Tomato. I wouldn't say I'm like a dedicated huge tomato fan, but I like, I like some tomatoes. I can fuck up some tomatoes, you know? We're gonna cut the tomatoes. And I don't, I'm not in any way um, somebody who knows what they're doing when it comes to being in the kitchen, so don't at me, okay? I'm gonna cut these in little chunks. Try the tomato first. Mmm, that's fresh. I'm not trying to squish them to shit, but like it's a little hard because they're slipping out of my fingers like little worms. 
tomatoes. We're not done yet though, folks. All right, now we got cucumber. Um, first of all, I'm gonna kind of like clean off my workspace because it's gonna be gross for the cucumber. <coughs> I feel like the cucumber deserves some respect, you know? Like, giving it a clean workspace. I love myself some cucumbers. They're crunchy, lovely. Oh. Good cucumber. Mix a little bit of this up. Not that I like need to mix this up, I just... Lemon, because lemon just makes everything fresh. Pure lemon juice or whatever, you can't see it. Wow, this is really satisfying. Nice. Wow, that's a nice shade of yellow. White, yellow, white, yellow. Shit ton of lemon juice. So I bought this Pure Plate Creations Dill Seasoning Paste. Jesus, this is not working out for me. Dill is coming out. Holy shit. That looks disgusting. It looks like actually like a bird just shit all over my salad. I'm not even lying. Like, I'm not even kidding right now. We've got feta. Palmetto olives. No matter where I go, I'm always gonna want you there. And it has like a tangy kind of taste to it because I got it out of this lemon flavored thing at Loblaws. Anyways, pretty stoked about it. Basil's a for sure thing, right? Like if you get anything with basil and then you add in Palmetto olives, tomatoes, all that, it's gonna be really good, like you know that. So dill, it's a, we're going a little crazy today. We're going a little crazy. You gotta do crazy shit in life, you know? I have to get ready for work. Gotta make a living, folks. You can't be sitting here cutting olives all day. Yep. I can look it over with catchy songs. Alright, we're done. We're done. We're done. We're done. Ah! Got ourselves a very healthy, very easy, quick little meal. I don't really know what else to say right now, so I'm just gonna say goodbye. I'm editing this video and I just realized I ate pesto and I have it on my lip and on my cheek. Anyways, I'm a mess and I just wanted you to know. So like, if you feel bad for me, like and subscribe. Goodbye, mofos.